Hello everyone, today we are going to show you how to integrate Active Directory into TrioFox. TrioFox is very easy to set up and integrate with the existing Active Directory and NTFS permissions. TrioFox is installed on a clean Windows Server 2016 or 2019 virtual machine. You can see from the diagram on the screen, TrioFox is installed in your network where you have Active Directory and file servers. Once it is installed and configured, you will log in as a TrioFox administrator and will be taken directly into the dashboard. Once in the dashboard, click on the Active Directory button in the right panel. It will take you to a window where you will enter your domain controller, IP address, or FQDN along with its credentials. Next screen will display more options that you can choose when integrating your Active Directory. You can see that you also publish user's home drive here. In this case, we will not select any additional options, just go with the defaults. Go ahead and click on Apply. It will discover all of your servers, file servers, in the network. You can choose the server you would like to add and provide remote access to. After that, you will see your TrueFox server along with the servers that you added under My Servers. Now go ahead and click on one of your file servers. Upon successful connection, it will list all the shares on your file server. After going to that share, you will see all the files and folders in that share. Now to provide remote and mobile access, click on Access Control and the User or Active Directory Security Groups. I am going to go into My Active Directory and browse to a user group that I will allow to access this share from home and external locations. Now that Active Directory integration is complete, I am going to log in as a user who is added under Access Control and show you that the user will see the share that he has access to. Once you log in, you will see that it will take you to the file browser and you can see the share that this user has access to, along with the files that are inside of it. Now I'm also going to use TrioFox Windows Client on a Windows 10 machine which will create a map cloud drive and I will see the share that I have access to. As you can see the share shows up that you have access to along with its files and folders. Thank you for watching this video.